This demo is from an in-production build. Okay. So this is a 2D uh, Souls-like. This is one that looked interesting that I wanted to check out. This may take a few minutes on first launch. Has to load all the shaders or whatever, I guess. Um, I don't know how I feel about 2D Souls likes in general. I'm usually okay with them. I remember Sultan's is it Sultan's Sanctuary? Sultan Sacrifice? The first one, not the second one that came out. I remember being somewhat into that. And uh they've been hit or miss for me for the most part. I'm kind of a fan of the 3D Souls like games that have been coming out. The ones that get cracked in and talked about anyways usually have something kind of like worthwhile to them or they're fun. The 2D ones are hit and miss for me. Uh, so this and there's another one. There's another demo that I want to check out as well. Uh, Sultan Sanctuary was the first one. Okay, Sacrifice is the second one then. Um, Mandragora and Bikround, I think, is the other one. So, I'm interested in this because it looks good, you know, like graphically, it's interesting looking. I didn't realize there would be shaders and a whole bunch of shit it, that has to install. Otherwise, I would have done a first run so that all this was done. Usually, I do. So, if you ever see that, like, I have, like, a minute in a game or, like, five minutes in a game or something... It's usually because I tried to do that before streaming. <laughs> I didn't realize this would have that. But whatever. Let's take a look. Oh. A pile of seeds. Oh. A pile of seeds. Maybe the thief is a squirrel. I have to dodge next time or I'm dead. Maybe the thief is a squirrel. Vanguard. These elite fighters within the ranks of the Inquisitors employ raw physical prowess, massive shields, and brutal two-handed weapons to carry out the will of the King Priest. I cannot choose any other. I can only choose Vanguard. It seems. Enter your name. All right. Let's see how it is, shall we? I know I'm already breaking my rule. First minute into spooky Halloween horror season. As Inquisitor of Crimson by not playing a horror game. As Inquisitor of Crimson City, I've been tasked by the King Priest to hunt down an enemy of the state, a witch. Before I mercifully killed one of her sisters, it was seemingly cursed and was seemingly cursed for it. The King Priest personally tortured her to the point she divulged Grav Seep Swamp as a possible rendezvous point. The, the lands ah the lands outside the city limits are lawless and filled with abominations, not of this world, but I am an Inquisitor, and there is no man or beast that can stop me from carrying out my mission. Evade is RT. Okay. It seems I'm really on my own now. Let the adventure begin. Let me see what we have for options real quick. Resolution scale. Cool. Okay. Honestly, a decent amount of um options. Not bad. These scavengers are never alone. I need to be careful. So the first thing I see right now that w is going to be hard to get used to is I think the UI is way too small and a, in a place that's hard to see clearly. Kind of cool that we have some air attacks there. Like in the bottom left there, those three really, really thin. 
bars are really difficult to see. Light leather. Okay. Sharpening stone. Okay, there we go. That's what I was actually looking for, was healing. That's... Is that a parry? It must be a parry. Pheasant meat. Or it's like a shield bash, I guess. No, it is like a parry, I think. Yeah, it is. It is, in fact, a parry. Parry mechanics are very hot these days. Very in vogue. This must be old Wickham. Or what's left of it. As is the style of the times, that's right. You know, I think this game looks pretty good, but it also, in my opinion, has kind of a, uh, like, mo like, mobile phone game quality to the way it's set up. And I think it might be because of the action buttons being in the bottom left. Oh, no lockpicks. Lockpicks, huh? Doesn't open from here. Okay. So we must go back around. This is a bonfire, essentially. Yes, it is. Oh my god, look at this tree. Holy crap. Endurance. Strength. Constitution. Vigor. And defense. Go so strength. Offensive node. Talent point. Interesting. Okay. Level up. Eat eight hundred and thirty-five. I have four hundred and seventy. Hey, where do you think you are going? Give you a choice: head or guts. Gross. A parry timing is very, very easy to do, which is nice. Uh, 
Locked. Okay. It's a big shield. Baby back, bitch. Am I just dead now? Guess not. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Guys are a real pain. Bandit hose. Oh, we got a whole inventory system, do we? Okay. You do like me an inventory system? Here's my body. UFO 50 really does have it all. It even has a game that isn't part of it. I do want to see what's in this chest this time. Sharpening stone and coal. So what do I need the sharpening stone for? Like I know what it does theoretically, but a whole bunch of skills, huh? There's actually a lot to this game. Holy crap. Increases your weapon's physical damage by 10% and physical critical chance by 10% for two minutes. This is pretty cool. That was not very cool. I do like what I'm seeing in this so far, though. Brigand vest. I somehow doubt that's going to be male. That's going to be more leather bullshit, I think.
The look of this game reminds me of a game called Pascal's Wager that I played a uh, while back. And that is a phone. That was a mobile game. So I think that's where my, uh, my preconceived thoughts on how this style is comes from. I thought Pascal's Wager was cool. I thought that was a neat game. So it's, it's by no means uh, meant to be de derisive. Look at that shield. Hell yeah. Apparently something dropped there, a fang. Oh, hey, another checkpoint. Now I can level up. I think I keep going strength. Blood craze. Eternal rage. I mean, that sounds just like me for real, for real. Do it. I assume we're gonna have like a mini boss. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I see. You can't parry with this shield. That's the... That's the problem with it. Well, not problem. That's the trade-off. Wow, you fuckers. Can't open. Okay. So you have to go in the well. Old Wickham sewers. Oh, smells in here. That voice acting. <laughs> Good sound bit. Honestly, yeah, pretty good sound bit. Not wrong. I really like how this game looks, actually. A metal hook on the ceiling. I'm gonna need a grappling hook to get through it. Like, I like the, um... The environmental design is fucking top-notch. Better sword would be nice. That is a big old rat down there. Oh, oh, that is a pool of bad shit. Okay. So how's it going, Ace? Just gonna ignore those fools this time. Also, I'm gonna try this way. Oh, there's nothing this way. Can't 
go down there. Okay. I feel you, man. All right. Puking everywhere. Like my goddamn cats, man. Biggest rat I've ever seen. That's not natural. <laughs> Got it. Nice. Focus ring. Okay. Negative 10% to mana cost. Hell yeah. That's great. Boy, I would love to get another weapon. So this ability is inner strength from this. How do I equip that? Can I equip that? Adrenaline costs 30 for that. Oh, okay. I see. I see. Is that death? That's death. Okay. Merchant's Road. Oh, that's why that door won't open, I guess. Get younger all the time, they do. This one must have been ripped straight from his mother's tit before they slapped the helmet on him. What's this? I thought they stopped trying to get the bodies. No matter. Let's get you some company, boy. We got a new weapon. It's pretty cool. Uh, what I should do is maybe make a second set. Mace with this. Is there a way to switch between them? There is. Yo, hell yeah.
Whoa, what? Wow. That trap hurts. There's another there. Look at that little goblin bastard down here. Savage broadsword. It's less damage. But it scales with more shit. We're scaling with um with strength though. Looks like it scales better with dex. That's why the scaling with this is so good, because I want strength. And this scales A. A scaling with strength. We'll stick with this. Ooh, two levels. Nice. I mean, I'm just going to keep going strength, probably. Eternal Rage seems good. You deal 20% more damage while at maximum adrenaline, so I'm going to have to get a whole bunch of adrenaline for that. That's, the skill tree is kind of crazy, especially when you consider that's literally just one. This is just the Vanguard skill tree. This is the Vindicator one, the Wild Warden one, Nightshade, the Spellbinder, and the Flameweaver. Oh, well, say, you looking for a guy to wick him? Hey, it's Gerald. Your guy. Gerald Burrow, adventure extraordinaire at your service. Not cheap, but worth every penny. I'm currently banned from this city. <laughs> You're misunderstanding in a dice game. <laughs> and in Billy's daughter. But if you could put in a good word with Commander Claiborne, I'm your guy. Let's see what I can do. You are one in a million, stranger. Just remember the name. Gerald Burrow. But if anyone asks, please don't tell them where to find me. Gerald Barra. Gerald Barra. What are you buying? <laughs> so this is Wickham. Not my frog. A new face. <laughs> a cause of celebration around these parts. Rosalie, around for everyone on me. Drink and be merry, Inquisitor. Who knows what tomorrow might bring to Wickham? Thank you. You're welcome, friend. Drink and forget tomorrow. We only live once. Right. An inquisitor. Hope you're not here for any of my patrons. I suspect you're looking for Commander Claiborne. Hmm. He's at the end of the street. Guards outside the door. Oh, and uh, if you ever find yourself back this way, stop by. Got something that might test those famed abilities of a Crimson City Inquisitor. All right, what do you got? Great cookbook. Who looks pretty good? I have a bunch of shit I could sell.
Yo, what's up, Ike? So the commander is down here somewhere, right? An inquisitor in Wickham. An interesting development, but none of this humble tailor's business. When you see Claiborne, do as he asks or you won't get what you came here for. He's fair, but does not take kindly to demands. There is one thing you can do for me. Wickham is no longer safe for me to operate out of. I was wondering if a kind word from an Inquisitor could help speed up the vendor permit process in Crimson City. Right. Not even I have that kind of power. I have another idea. I'm not that desperate. There's a caravan nearby. Could use a tailor. Let me see your map if you're any good merchants are gathering here. I see. It may do. Until I figure out another way out of my predicament. A tale for another time. It's Shirin. And I must be going Shirin. immediately. Hope oh, this means there's a discount in my future. Hope is free. I'm expensive. But worth every penny. See you at the caravan, Inquisitor. Okay. Some decent uh, dialogue choices. Man, the environmental design is very good. Underground is currently off limits. Please keep moving. Hey, Ella. You know why I don't trust trees? They're a little shady. Here to announce yourself, Inquisitor. Is this who I need? Let's pretend I have time yeah. for you, Inquisitor. I've no allegiance to Crimson City, but you made it through old Wickham alone. So you've no doubt got some pressing business. Let's hear it. I'm looking for a witch in Grav's Seep Swamp. Only way through is blocked, and I assume you know a way through. Aye, you've thinned the numbers of the bandits, I hear. And that's why we're speaking. But I'm fighting for the city on two fronts, and can't help but use my leverage to ask for your assistance. The West two fell fronts. the night some months ago. Something killed the good lords and ladies. All of them trapped by the massive gate separating them from the riffraff. Then bandits took over Old Wickham to the east, all but cutting off our supply chain. They've been raiding our stocks, coming up through the old ruins beneath the city. You want me to clear them out, is that it? I suspect your liege leaves you no choice but to get your errand done, no matter the cost. Passage to the undergrounds back the way you came. For my sake, best of luck, Inquisitor. All right. So now we can go to the underground. This feels almost, this is very much a uh, Diablo vibe going on here. Like a 2D souls like Diablo or something. Doesn't open. Come on. Really? Oh, that pisses me off. You can't see the fucking platform to fall onto. <sighs> oh. Had a little hiccup there. Like, is that it there? Try this way first. All right. 
what is this, Rugrats? Yeah, exactly. Ooh, let's see what's in here. Oh, interesting. Fast travel, huh? Is that a loot goblin? So yeah, this is Diablo. <laughs> Little fucker got away. Diablovania. much damage. It actually wasn't that much damage. Bloody ear. It is Diablo. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, I'm collecting their ears. Just like it the doesn't open. Nope. Never mind. I do have a map. It's just not very good down here. Railed gate key. Nice. No lock picking minigame, huh? Diagram minor stone skin potion. Map fragment. Okay. So this is back at the beginning here. 
Can I see what my quest is down here? Clear out the banner ridden ruins. So I need to kill one more bandit by the looks of it. Oh, is this it? Okay, that's it. We're done down here. Oh, I'm dumb. <laughs> I forgot about that trap. Quickly go heal. No level up either. Okay, whatever. Kinda sucks not having the parry ability anymore. The shield bash. With this giant shield, but... Meh. Or maybe you have to charge it up. That might be actually it. Quite the reputation, you inquisitors. Not a sterling one, but your skills definitely live up to their notoriety. I sent word. My men have cleared a path for you to the monastery. Go through there and the old cemetery, and path will lead you to the swamp. The west gate is open to you as well. I honor my debts. Should you find your way around these parts again, a pair of skilled hands is much needed these nights. Best of luck with your witch hunt, Inquisitor. A man named Gerald Barra. Barra. <laughs> Barra. Wanted permission to enter. Expelled him for his own safety. There are several husbands and fathers that would like to string him up, and I can't protect him. Tell him to find another town to make into his personal brothel. I don't want to get too into lore stuff because if I decide I want to play this game, I'll just get into it at that point, right? Rather than the demo. Not available in the demo. Ella, you know what one wall says to the other wall? You have something for sale? Hey, buy something, will you? you? Used to be rich, I probably. All right, what do you got? Oh my God! Look at this stuff. Hey, the claymore. Heretic shield. I wonder if I can... I want that claymore. I could afford this. I did play Nightmare Cart, yeah. I did, I did. Now I can afford this. How do I unequip something quickly? Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god, the slow attack. It's everything I ever wanted. This is going to get me killed. I feel it.
You definitely should play Nightmare Card at some point. I think uh, she fixed a bunch of issues with it. It's good, right? Well, your face says no, but my optimism says fuck yeah. Take another look at my face. There's well, your answer. That really sucks. I'm not gonna make a living without selling hope to the fool hardy. Tips to the treasure hungry. No oh, bullshit. What? No. I'm a man of the world. A natural born treasure hunter with knowledge of all things traps, treasures, maps, and monsters. I make it my business to know things and help those a bit more reckless to find their way to the lap of luxury. Uh, not sure what that means, but here's a place you can go for now. A place to go. That's, uh, something. Yeah, I think I can work with this. Because I kind of have to. Yeah, I haven't changed it. Oh, there's, there's a camp down here. Okay, this is where I'm supposed to go. Okay. Oh! Uh... Uh-oh. I thought I was gonna fall in the swamp here. Didn't realize it would be so shallow. Oh my god, I am getting some bad frames there. So, the block button just does nothing anymore. Which makes sense, I suppose, but... Actually, I guess it's probably not a block button. It would be your left hand. Oh, there's a thing. Mandrake root. Okay. Wonder if I can grind out that last little bit for that level. I'm gonna go see. I think that's enough. Warlord. While in combat, you generate one adrenaline per second for each nearby enemy. Okay, let's get Eternal Rage. Whoops, that's the wrong button. There we go. I do like the reach of the Claymore goes through environment. No, 
I think that's the way you have to go. That attack is so slow. Whoa. That was weird. Doesn't open. Fuck. I saw that there was something up with that too. No, it's that too late. That seems like a secret there. I do miss a slightly faster attack. Doesn't open from here. Okay, so you can't go this way. You have to go through the opening up here. Okay, fair enough. I'm bored. The scaling with this weapon is so much better, too. No, can't go up there yet. Wickham Monastery map fragment. This is a front door, I assume. Surely that's the front door. Make the run back easier. Bandit captain, huh? So the poison does kill you. Okay. I was wondering if it would take me down to 1 HP, but no. It will actually just kill you. I think I have an antidote as well.
keep getting these frame hiccups. And I'm not really sure what's causing it. It's pissing me off, though, because it's only happening when I use that attack. When I'm using my uppercut. Kind of annoying. Oh, it slows you down. Devious Edge. Air Trap. How can I equip that? Or can I? Diagram, Signet of the Wolf. Goldsmithing diagram, okay. City. But if you leave me here, they're going to kill me. What's in it for me? Uh, if I had anything left, think I'd be in here? Uh, help me, and I can figure out why. Entropy is within you. Entropy? If you don't want to wind up in my condition, best let me out. All right, sure. I scried a place, a place of sack. All right, that's nice. It opens from the other side. From the other side. What the fuck is that reward? That's something I can equip? Oh, okay. Pass through the old monastery to reach the swamp. So yeah, you do have to just wait for that to charge up. Got it. Okay. That's a pretty good skill, too. Pretty good shield skill or whatever. Not bad. Not bad. Takes forever to get ready, though. So can't 
can't go through that way. outside right oh in the yeah I remember now there's an area up here there's a doorway I couldn't open before I wasn't really paying attention I don't know if I got a key or something though whoop I did get the key. Okay, good. Rat, huh? Oh, God. Come on, dude. Oh, I'm dead. God damn it. I got stuck on the stupid thing. Ugh. Got stuck on the stupid skeleton. Ugh. I should have just gone back and healed, but honestly, I just don't want to fight all these useless dudes anymore. I just want to get to where I need to get to. Down. There we go. Okay. Now I'll explore down this way. was in a really rude spot. Oh, hello. Cemetery. Goat? I have expected these skeletons to not actually die. It opens from the other side. Uh oh. Servant, grant me passage. I have business with your creator. Follow 
caretaker. Okay. Oh, there's no, there's no checkpoint anywhere near here. Holy Christ. Yeah, no, I missed it somewhere. There's no way there's not something close by that I didn't miss. Can't tell if that's supposed to be the witch I'm tracking or if she's going to see the witch. Can you fucking move, man? God damn it. here, isn't it? Yep. There it is. Oh, weird. This is from the beginning. Interesting. Okay. So we opened up a shortcut from that one, that old checkpoint there. That's cool. Still kind of far, though. I saw a ledge there that it seemed like I should be able to climb. Oh my god. Kicked me right in the face. God, I can't believe that goes all the way down like that. Okay, this doesn't seem too bad of a fight. The run back is kind of a bitch, but that's fine. I wanted to see what's going on here. There's a ledge up there. No, it won't open from here. I don't think I can get up there. From the other side. Yeah, I think you have to go all the way around or something. I don't think I can get it from here. God, 
what an asshole. Oh my god. There we go. That was tough. Heavy attack. You would think I would have had that already, but apparently not. Okay, so heavy attack should definitely be that. And the uppercut should be that. Oh, you can charge it too. Sick. Oh. Okay. Mandragora. I can't wait to see more of this, actually. I really like the style of it quite a bit. Cool game. Cool game. <laughs>